I've had some really great opportunities for the different organizations that I've been able to work with from Meals on Wheels to Helio Health. Um, and, and probably one of the most remarkable experiences was working on the Landmark Theater Board. Um, the Landmark Theater was always just something that was part of my childhood. My mom used to take my sisters and I to see shows when we were younger and they grew up at the Landmark, both of my parents. Um, so my senior ball was there in high school. Matt and I had our wedding reception there. And um, it was within about a year after that that I had a couple of friends who were on the board who reached out and were looking for new board members. And after not too long of a time, um, I was given the opportunity to, to chair the board. And at the time, the theater was in a pretty dark place. And so we had a precarious scenario for a while. We hired the right people, we brought on the right board members and really turned things around. And it was a, a definite labor of love and was a lot of work and time, but it was wonderfully fulfilling to be able to be part of kind of the renaissance or the, the kind of rediscovery of what this organization was gonna be about to the point where that right around the time that I uh, left the board because my, my time was up, um, we were able to receive a $2 million grant from the state of New York. And that was something that was never, that was unimaginable when, when I first started. One of my first meetings was with like a bankruptcy attorney. I mean, it was that bad of a situation. And so to be able to be part of something that, and when you think about just the emotional impact that the landmark has on people, but also the economic engine, this is an organization that drives millions of dollars into the community and into downtown in particular, and so many businesses rely on it and focus on it. So that was extremely satisfying and incredible to be part of. Um, and since that point, I'm, I'm on the Center State CEO board and visit Syracuse, both incredibly uh, important organizations for supporting business and supporting travel and tourism to the community. And then United Way was always that board that um, was sort of my, like, I held it up. I started donating to the United Way when I was working as a cashier in high school at PNC grocery store and um, making $4.15 an hour or whatever it was at the time, uh, minimum wage. And I used to donate, I think 50 cents a week or something that I could afford on my little high school, basically paper route type of um, paycheck. And uh, so United Way was always kind of part of my, part of my blood back then and becoming, um, part of that organization and, and now having the incredible honor of chairing that board was is really, really special.